Calculus and physics, they go hand in hand, describing the physical law of the land. Let's start with the basics rectilinear right, motion, particle on a line, quite a simple notion. Displacement, it then needs to change in the position. The velocity, derivative, that's its definition. Differentiate again to get the acceleration. If you want to go backwards, you got to use integration. Velocity and acceleration have the same sign. The particle is speeding up along that line. Right is positive and left is negative. Remember all these rules. It's imperative. That's enough for the intro. I think you get the gist. It's time for us to move to the rest of the list. Two dimensional kinematics motion on a plane. This vector calculus in here about to get insane. We can calculate the slope of the moving particles path dy dt over dx dt. Just some simple math. Variables x and y defined in terms of t. Call the parametric equations now you can see the x and y components. We can treat them independently. The rest is rectilinear motion. You can do that easily. It's described using only one spatial dimension. I hope that didn't make you more confused. It wasn't my intention. How do you find the distance traveled? That's a good question. Just integrate this complicated looking expression. This morning, I stayed up all night to prepare, but I don't understand this question right here. She started talking, but I really couldn't hear. She said five minutes left and my face was like a fear. No, there must have been an error. My body shook its hair. I gave up, put my head down on the desk. And my headache got bigger. Chop one, chop two, chop my grade down. Chop my grade down, chop, chop my grade down. All that sis will do is just drop my grade down, drop, drop my grade down. I think I need some help. If you have problems with calculus, just come to me. They call me Dr. Woolsey, even though I have no degree. I got the straight A's on every test. You're in the hands of the very best. Sit down for a while and stay. I'll make that headache go away. Differential equations that is model reality The field of mathematics with the most practicality Propagations of waves or vibrations of springs And man, Isaac Newton is the calculus king His law of cooling sets of disproportionality Separate and integrate, that's my specialty Use the initial conditions to solve for that C Find K with another point, easy as 1, 2, 3 This type of problem is exponential growth Calculus and physics, we can use them both Oh! <laughs> 